that is up to the government to have a consultation or whatever. But according to my belief, election will be conducted in uh, our territory. Uh, I don't want to make a comment on that because uh, I'm not a minister, number one, and it's a matter of policy approach. So policy maker of the state must be uh, uh, applying their mind as to how it should be tackled with. If we look from the other side of the coin, in view uh, declaring that he will uh, abstain from participation in the municipal or town council, even by this election, I thought that is something uh, in line with your, uh, something consistent with your uh, established uh, uh, established uh, approach to your demand. So to me, it is not a surprising thing. It is somewhat consistent with your uh, demand. To me, it is a stupid idea. Uh, why, why? You have a church, you have a church, and that is your villager church or your union church. If I wanted to assist your church, then I should, I should uh, have consulted with you whether uh, you should need any help from us. If you voluntarily, in your morning, consent that uh, yes, you can help us in cleaning my church uh, building in its premises. So you do it, but without taking consultation or consent. If you wanted to clean my house, I can charge you on house trespass under criminal law. As a political party, you are not supposed nor expected to take such a stupid decision. I call it stupid. I call it stupid. Moreover, yesterday's concluded parliamentary election. Even though BGP party was not contesting parliamentary election in Nagaland segment, parliamentary segment. Rather, it was a NDPP candidate to whom we give our support because we have endorsed it. But it was the BGP who had the maximum uh, attack from the Christian community. Saying that your party has done so many uh, 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 atrocities or uh, inconvenient thing against our community in mainland India. That was the main reason. So under that given situation, without taking permission, if you come and set the permissions of my church, then you have to be present. That means you are undermining the sanctity of my church. That's why uh, even though whether it is a central leadership or state leadership or district or whatever leadership may be, such kind of stupid decision should not be taken by a political party. That is one. Number two, I should respect your institution, be it good or bad. I should respect because there is an indeed. I'm also an indeed. We have to respect each other. Otherwise, uh, to cohabit together will be very difficult to navigate. So as a political party, you should not be doing such thing. Unwarranted. Unless and until I speak out. I have no forum so over the social media or even in the print media. I dare to speak out. Because I'm in Naga first, and I'm also a Christian. And then you see the Privacy privacy Act. Why should I encroach into your private world without having the mandate of law? And you are seeking vote, people's vote, support, no? Unless I can cultivate and earn your respect, you'll never vote for me. That should be the basic idea of a political party. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter. And Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Twitter.